This will be a night for it, and that wicked weather is forcing crews to call off this search for a missing boater. Divers began scouring the waters of Wolverine Lake this afternoon. 7 Action News reporter Ronnie Dahl has the latest tonight on the search. The distress call came in around 4.30 this afternoon. That's when other boulders out on the lake noticed the 62-year-old man calling for help. This Labor Day weekend, an eerie stillness fell over Wolverine Lake. The usual end of the summer family fun was put on hold. Boulders were ordered off the water so rescue crews could search the murky water. Well, I've been a boulder for all my life. Bob Christie has lived on the lake more than 20 years. He understands what divers are up against. What are the conditions out there? Uh, the lake's murky, a lot of weeds on the bottom. It's about 60 feet where they're looking. And the problem with the divers is there's about eight foot of soot on the bottom, so the, there's no visibility. Divers can't see anything. As the daylight slipped into darkness, the search effort shifted gears into a recovery mission. Sonar equipment is brought in to aid the divers. We're told the man they are looking for is 62 years old. His family has been coming to the lake for years. He was an experienced boater, yet today he was alone, and authorities still aren't sure what he was doing in the moments before he drowned. We believe he might have been in the water swimming. However, his boat was not anchored. Uh, it was not running at the time. Uh, his ladder was down. Due to the weather, the search was called off late tonight. Divers will be back out here first thing Saturday morning. In Wolverine Lake, Ronnie Dahl, 7 Action News. All right, thanks a lot, Ronnie.